Hey everybody, thanks for wandering back out to the Digital Hermitage. I'm the Hermit, you can call me Hiccup. And guys, today I want to keep going and hop in some of those caves. You know, that has been a lot of fun, and every time I hop into one of these caves, we seem to find a new corridor, or a new path, or some kind of new room, or some new drop, or something, or some new, like, hole in the ground to go explore. So, I'm really excited to keep doing that. I definitely want to collect some more fur and claws, because I would like to level up the armor. But, on the flip side, I also want to collect some resources. I would like to collect a lot of the, the red jute and the trophy and stuff and decorate this place hold on something is attacking my stuff I hear <gasps> bad bad fen ring oh no guys how many wolves did we lose I do have a bunch of boar meat and deer meat in there and we do have a good, few good piles of boar meat in there I have hopped around in a couple of meadows since the last I've gotten to play a little bit Jeez, let me go sleep so we can get rid of all these creatures. Hang on, guys. Okay, maybe we can avoid any more interruptions this morning. Jeez. <clears throat> anyway, guys, I was trying to get around to saying uh, I've actually had a little bit of time to play off camera, and, and, and that hasn't happened lately. I feel like I've been absolutely booked with trying to get out extra episodes and series and stuff. But anyway... I got some time to play. We did go to that eye gouger camp. We've collected some gray dwarf eyes. We've got some core wood. We've got some normal wood. I even found a bunch of mushroom spots. Um, it's down here. Yeah, I've been clearing it out. You know, we'll go take a look real quick. I haven't really done much else out there, but uh, there is a good bit of wood and stuff. And I was saying we should collect a lot of the stuff that we're getting from the mountains today and decorate this place. I've got a bunch of trophy stands up that I got ready and uh, a few more placeables around the place. But uh, I'm really looking to decorate this place today. I want to try some curtains and stuff. Um, and guys, there's a, I think, hang on one second. Let me look through this real quick. There it is. Okay. Yeah, I thought so. I was, I was moving some inventory around and uh, look at this. We need to go find us some troll hide because I'm definitely placing one of those around. Have you guys seen this? This is my first time noticing one of these. I think I picked up some iron or something in one of the nearby chests to move around or bronze. I forget. No, you know what? It was the bronze for making all of the nails to make some of the platform, uh, the little trophy stands, and I noticed this, so yeah, definitely be gonna be using that by the end of the episode. But guys, these caves have given us so much to do and so much to explore and so much to see, so I'm really excited. Let's go ahead and I'm ditching this normal armor, guys. We're going up there in the Femris outfit. We're going up there, decked out as one of the wolves. Let me go drop my old armor off back at the house. All right, and then for the trip, I have packed, um, oh, why am I still carrying that Drake trophy? Uh, for the trip, I've also made myself, um, oh, I guess I'm going to need those as my main melee weapon. Yeah, we'll leave the, we'll leave the club behind. All right, I was kind of interrupted in the middle of that intro there with that stinking Fenris attack, but, uh, I'm pretty sure I told you guys, I've, I've, I've wandered around in some meadows. I have a tiny meadows right here, and then there's another meadows across the, the river here. Um, and it's not a whole lot, but you know, it, it did give me a couple of, um, a couple of raspberries. So I've been able to make some potions. I've got another couple of, uh, I've got a tasty mead and another healing mead brewing right now, but thankfully I was able to make another healing mead. So now I'm actually pretty good. I have about 10 or 11 healing potions stashed around here between all the chests somewhere, but we're going to take six with us today. I did make some obsidian arrows for the adventure today. Uh, shot a few birds while I was out doing that. Let's go take a look at the eye gouger camp. Um, it hasn't really come a long way. You know, it's not really something super fancy or anything, but uh, we did clear some trees around there because I am looking to get back into building, guys. I uh, do love the build, and I think I just saw that, is it it was it on the Steam page? Something about a build of the month that I don't know. I don't know that I'm that good, but... Uh, could be a lot of fun. I, I might, you know, it might be something that I try to do in creative mode, obviously, because it'll be such a massive build. But, you know, if that's something you guys would want to hang out with me for and let me try, I would love to do that. Um, It would be a lot of work, and I doubt I would I, I would have to make a few episodes about it because that would be what I what I would be doing in my spare time. But, uh, man, if that's something you guys want to see, because I would like to try. I don't know what I would build, honestly, but uh, that would be fun to try. So I've knocked down a lot of trees around here. And actually, guys, you know what else we found around here? Mushrooms. And you know, it's been days. Actually, I've been running around kind of just chopping these trees and replanting them as I go and rechop. Oh, yeah, all the mushroom, all the um, blueberries are back. So I'm hoping the mushrooms will be back as well. Give me some of your eyes. 
Oh, man. Yeah, we've been able to collect plenty of Grey Dwarf Eyes. I'm hoping the mushrooms are back. Oh, maybe. I marked every patch, no matter how small. <laughs> I've been desperate for mushrooms, I think you guys know from the last few episodes. But uh, we've actually done a pretty good job finding a few more around here. Oh, here we go. That one was kind of hard to see. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, yeah, okay. So they're all back. So, yeah, we've done a good job. I'm not going to gather any more right now. Um, yeah, we found mushrooms. We've been able to get gray dwarf eyes. I really haven't built up this little shack anymore. Um, it was kind of a, a silly little work in progress. Even when I was out here making this place in the first place and just chopping gray dwarf eyes, I just built this for fun over the evening. Um, I don't know. We might come back and do something with it. But look at all the goods. We've got plenty of wood. So much core wood, actually. I need to start planting some normal trees. But honestly, the pine trees are pretty much all I got out here. And I'll keep chopping those. It's fine. It's fine. We got good anyway, I'm rambling too much. You're all caught up. It's only been a few days in game. Uh, I've made some pies and some bread. This is my meal right now. I really enjoyed this meal. Uh, the locks meat's really easy to keep around because there's three locks that keep spawning near my barley farm. So every time I go out there to get barley, I get more locks meat. And onions are pretty easy to keep. This is just a super easy, sustainable meal. But now with all these mushrooms, guys, I'm going to make some serpent stew. I don't know that we'll use that for today. Look at all the mushrooms. Oh, there's my other potions. Yeah, so I've got about nine potions around. Got a, I've got a good stack of mushrooms, though. Look at all them great dwarf eyes. And some more mushrooms, guys. Yeah, we're doing good now. Doing good, finally. Oh, and speaking of mushrooms, guys, there are mushrooms in the swamps. Um, I I was told about this, and I haven't. I still haven't seen any myself. Not that I've been looking recently uh, in the swamps. I, I was kind of hanging out there, uh, you know, doing my own thing in, in the black forest, and I found them. But uh, I do need to look around in the swamps. I just don't know that I've ever looked for them there. But I have seen the proof. It exists. They are there. All right, enough lollygagging. Let's get out to the boat. I'm <laughs> jumping so many portals. So many portals. All right, guys, we've already searched. Actually, have we? I don't know that we finished searching this cave. I think I grabbed six fur and we just ran back out. So let's go ahead and just start here, shall we? Um, guys? Are you seeing this? Okay, I, I lied. I guess we haven't seen the whole cave because, uh, look at this. We just came in. I went right, and that's the hole we've been in. I took a left, and I started seeing this. Look at this. What is going on? Also, look at this. What is going on? I know I'm kind of like risking the armor, but I really want to get down there, but I have no idea if we're going to be able to get back up or not. Uh, guys, let me go get some wood real quick. Oh my gosh, that was so many portal hops again, but oh my gosh, I'm so excited. All right, so we're going to look around a little bit before we go committing to building. Can I even build in caves, guys? Has this been established? I don't know that I know. Can't be placed in a dungeon. Yeah, okay. Oh, it'll let you make miscellaneous stuff in here. But it won't let me throw down a crafting bench. So there's no way that I'm going to be able to... Oh, but do you guys see what is down there? Like, I have to go and check that out. Alright, then we're going to throw this lumber and stuff up here at the front, because I guess we can't use it in here. Um... Interesting that we can throw down the miscellaneous stuff, though. That means we can throw a campfire in here? That's cool. It means you could put a portal in a dun Hmm. Maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, guys, let's... I'm gonna see... Okay, since I can't build, I don't want to just drop down there. So... Uh, maybe I should bring a portal. I might go get the stuff I need for a portal. We're gonna make this jump. <gasps> Look at that! It's just floating down there! Oh, I want to drop down onto it so bad. This is this a dead end? Alright, this is a dead end. Okay, we're gonna go get naked. Possibly grab some portal material. I'll be right back. Okay, we gotta do this quick, because I am freezing. Burr, 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 it's cold out here! Okay, 
I'm trying to be as smart about this as possible so we don't lose anything. Uh, I don't know about that fall. This fall looks much more manageable. Um, so we've eaten. Hey, I'm actually just cold in here, even naked. Interesting. Okay. Uh, I'm going to use the bone mass ability. I don't know if that's actually going to help with the fall damage at all. And we have enough stuff just to make one more portal if we survive, guys. Oh my gosh. <gasps> what is this dungeon here? Okay, we are freezing. Let's see if we can set up the portal. Oh, you have to set up... Well, okay, so we can't... Yeah, we can't set up a portal in here then. What is going on? Do you guys see this? Where are we? What is happening? I think we can get inside here. I think we are... Yeah, I think this is actually, like, the top of... Oh, we might be, like, glitched here. <laughs> I get into all the places I'm not supposed to. Oh, no. Okay, well, we're going to die here, but the only thing we're losing is some portal material and a hammer. Yeah, it does not look like we can get inside again. Oh, that's crazy. Guys, this is absolutely crazy. Yeah, this is definitely more of the dungeon that we could get inside of. I think. They look like rooms, right? They look like rooms that we should be able to explore. We're going to freeze to death up here. This is crazy, though. This is really cool. I'm, I'm actually really entertained right now. Look at the endless abyss. Maybe we should just jump. I might do it right before we die of freezing. We'll just jump. There's no getting back out. Ah, well, actually, I guess we could. We could stack lumber. But that's kind of silly. There's got to be a way to get down here into more of this cave and cavern because this is so passageways that we can walk in. It's not even funny. Yeah, I'm never going to get back out. This is crazy, though. That's a lot of fun. All right, we're going to try and get back up there in the cave with our good stuff and find a way out of here. Let's go ahead and jump, guys. Whoa. <laughs> Into the abyss we go. Ah! Ah! Oh, my gosh. Ah! What? Okay, that was one of the most horrible Valheim nightmares I've ever had. I... I don't know what just happened. <laughs> oh, man, that was absolutely crazy, guys. What just happened? Um... We need to get out there and look around and see if we can get into some more of those caves. Unless... Unless we already have? I'm not sure. Hang on. Let me get all my stuff equipped again. Yeah, this has got to be it. I think these are the caverns we were just walking on top of out there in the little nightmare scape. <laughs> that was crazy to find. Anyway, we need to go find another mountain. Enough goofing off out here. Although this was a lot of fun. That was really crazy. Um, I guess I'm going to bring these home real quick. No reason to leave this material here. We have spent a lot of time goofing off. Portal, ice caves, and there we go. All right. So we've got a cave here. That's where the portal was. We should remove that and rename it cave. <laughs> that death, though. <laughs> All right. So we've got a little bit more of the mountains to discover. Let's keep looking around, uh, especially right now while it's actually pretty bright out. I'm actually really liking this. Oh, wow, guys. Look at us move. We're going to find more caves in no time. We can cover the ground now. Wow, this is a pretty epic mountain biome. Day 447. Come on, show me another cave. I think this is one. I think this is one. Oh, yeah. Very nice. All right, let's set up the portal. And let's get inside. Finally, took forever to get out here. Good to go. Got the flesh rippers on. In we go. All right. This is going to be a little more risky than last time. We're wearing some weaker armor. And we have weaker weapons. 
that's okay. Oh wow, look at this go down. Bats! I just very much dislike the bats. Come on. Come on! Come on! Blah, get out of here. Whoa, what is this? Behind the breakable wall. That's awesome. Hey, how did you get out here? Whatever. Guys, it's really dark in here. I should have made a torch. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I've ever seen these. See, every time we come into a cave, we find some new structure or new stuff. Or Get out of here, bats. I will take the leather scrap, though. Come here. Oh, is that the people hunting the wolf? Horrible. But that's about what we're we're getting ready to do. Um, because these wolves are about to come to life, and it's about to be go time. Ah! Wow, yeah, that hurt a good bit, actually. Man, that is tough to time and counter. Only 12 sneak. We don't sneak a lot. All right, that worked out well. It's a small den of ooves. These cave markings are great. I'm gonna have to go around and try to, like, collect all of the cave markings that I can find and, like, see if they... But, you know, all put together, probably tell a story of some kind. We'll have to go around and start taking pictures. That, that could be fun. We could make a day out of that. There we go. Oh, down and down and down we go. This is a deep one, guys. Oh, here we go. So much crystal. I, I'm telling you guys, when we get to building after the next couple of episodes. I am so making a greenhouse as an addition to the... I don't know. I don't know. We're just going to have to make a whole glass room somewhere on the mountain. Nice little sunroom. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. You know, we actually have to be on our guard now because these guys are going to be tough. I meant to try to jump over that. Boom. Oh, we should eat, too. Ah yes, more of the red jute. What exactly can we make? Uh, is it is it just furniture? Oh yeah, look at that, curtains and carpet. Oh yeah, guys, we're gonna get to decorating and making our our cabin look awesome. We collect as much fair hair and jute and fangs and trophies. We're gonna get all the things. Pretty big room. No room in inventory. Uh, I do need those. Give me the fangs. All the goods. Collecting all the goods. All right. That might be this whole cave. Those walls don't break. <laughs> all right. So that's for down here. Let's climb back up. And uh, I think there was one more little doored, walled off room we could go check. Hup. Oh my gosh, guys, I love this armor. Just zooming around. Okay, okay, okay. Anybody home? <laughs> I didn't kick it open at all. Look at this tiny little place. Oh, we can't use the, uh, the flesh rippers in a torch. That makes sense, though. Well, this is a little just crappy dead end. Or not. Oh, yeah. More Fenris hair. We need so much Fenris hair to keep leveling this up, I'm pretty sure. Look at that. Hello, cultist. Yeah, I was about to say, you were being pretty chill there. Ah! Ooh. All right. More hair matted on the wall. It's gross. Meh. All right, I think that's this cave. Let's get out of here. Yeah, tight, tight quarters, tight quarters. 
All right, let's go ahead and mark this one so we don't get confused. <laughs> let's see if we can keep exploring until we get a stack of everything else, though. All right, there's that cave. Let's keep... Look. Is that another one right beneath us? No way. No, okay. I didn't think they'd be that close together. We're going to keep scouring this side of the mountain, though. This seems to work pretty well. Just find, like, the outer edge of the mountain, you know, and just kind of, like, run around and look up. And that covers the outer ring. And they, ha they I have seen them spawn out here. Then we'll go back up and we'll check up there after. Well, I only have a minute of uh, rested bonus left. I guess the next time we throw down the portal, we should go home and take a breather. Take a peek over the ledge here. Hey, that looks like one we haven't visited. Nice. There are a lot of caves on this mountain. All right, he sees nothing. <laughs> yeah, let me go home, empty the pockets, and get the rest of bonus. Okie dokie. We got a small rest of bonus, but that's okay. Shouldn't take long. Ooh. I like that entrance. That looks awesome. Go away! Silly bats. Yeah, that was a cool thing to walk right into. Oh, look at this. Treasure! We'll take it. We'll take it. Would like to make a treasure chest at some point. One of those little treasure trophy chests. Oh, yeah. Kick down the wall. What do we have here? Okay. Let's go ahead and pop bone mass. You didn't hear anything, woofins? Alright, we do have some Fenris hair on the walls here. Ooh. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, these claws work great, actually. Oh, there's too many! Oh, there's a lot. There's a lot of them. Uh, kick it. Yeah, kick him. <laughs> hi yeah. Oh, I'm on top of it. Ah! Okay, okay. Ooh. Lots of olves. Gotta get them olve trophies. Don't really care for the meat pile. Not worried about sausages anymore. But guys, if you didn't know, you can get uh, intestines and stuff from those meat piles, which makes, I don't know, just makes these mountain caves so awesome. Not that you can get an infinite supply up here or anything, but, you know. Oh, it stopped him. Yeah, come on. I want to try and counter this block. Come on, come on. Ow. No. Come on. There it is. There it is. All right. Okay. I think I've got the timing. So it's, it's really delayed, actually. It's a lot later than you think it would be. That was small. As I'm not worried about the bronze and the iron and stuff, because it's really heavy, hard to carry, and you can't bring it back through the portal, so I'm not worried about breaking all these braziers. Oh gosh, let's get rid of the dog. Turn around and deal with the bats. Bats, come here. Bats, oh. Oh. Gotcha. Hi. Yeah. Alright, anything else? Oh, look at this branching paths here. Look, go away, bats. Ha, fire got him. Oh! Alright. Eat something, eat something. Roll around behind him. There we go. Aya, aya. Hey, kick him. Hey. Kick you! Ah, jeez, just stand in the fire. Actually, this fire resistance armor. Yeah, actually. I forgot about that. Maybe not. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. I think there's this path. Oh, yep, there's a cultist. Around the corner, big guy. Hiya! Kick him! And kick! Uh, and kick! Oh, he got me! Ow! I've got claws too, big guy. Jeez, that's bright. You and your fire. Give me all those jutes. Red jute. 
Ooh, more cultists. Turn around, big guy. There we go. What? Oh, you're so lucky. You got lucky. Oh, let's let him come out of this corner. Kick it. Yeah, kick and punch and punch. Ah. Let's just get him, get him, get him. Okay. Woo. Oh, yeah, slowly taking that burn damage, but healing pretty good, too. Plenty of jute here. Wow, look at this little temple. Oh, man, guys, look at the fur here. Love it. Plenty of claws. What does it take to level up these weapons, anyways? It just Was it just silver? I forget. All right, how are we doing on material so far? Wow, 30 hair, two trophies, some treasure, five claws. Doing great, actually. Oh, my rested bonus is gone. <gasps> oh, I need a cultist trophy. Uh, don't care about the obsidian. We can get that all over the mountain. All right, let's go home. Let's drop all this stuff off. Ah, get, uh, 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 oh, I need to stop sprinting upstairs, actually. It's getting me killed. <laughs> that hurt a lot, actually, falling that far. Ah, okay. Let's get out of here and go home. I need a rested bonus again anyway. Okay, guys, what do you think? Can we find one more mountain on this, on this, uh, one more, can we find one more mountain on this mountain? Um, can we find one more cave on this mountain? Um, I feel like this, this, this whole mountain has been absolutely huge and covered with caves. Um, we've been really lucky to find as many as we have. How many have we found here? One, two, three, four, five caves. Might be one over here, might be another one on the, uh, we might be out of luck, actually. Actually, guys, we're gonna run back this way. See if we can spot one down there. Be right back if we find another one. I'm looking to squeeze one more, one more cave though. I'd like to see one more cave before we leave this place. But let's look around. If there are no more caves, we'll probably wrap it up and go look for a mountain in the, the next episode. Wow, guys, look at that. I had to stop here a minute and just share this with you that mountain probably not a very big mountain with a lot of caves on it but you know it still looks awesome from here all right this is the undiscovered part hey look at that we do have another cave oh my gosh all right we're gonna do this cave this will be our final one of the day but we're, we're gonna check this mountain on the way back to the boat over here there might be another cave on the way back to the boat all right, let's do this. Look at that. Very nice. Another cave. Guys, getting so lucky with these cave finds. There we go. All right, let's get in here. Starting with another door to kick down. Oh, yeah. Lots more crystal already. Nothing. Okay, nothing here. Pretty soon I'm going to have so many of those photos that I'm just going to... I'm going to have doubles. I'm going to be retaking all of them. Forget what ones I've already taken pictures of. Look at this tiny little corner. Nothing back here. Oh. I take it back! I take it back! Ugh. Get that cloth out of my face! Ah! Okay. And hey, we did get some jute. Are we getting... I think we do get jute here, uh, that red cloth from cutting this stuff occasionally. I don't think it's very often. But I must be. Yeah, we got two from something. Hello, wolf. Gotcha. Oh! Oh, I guess it is time to eat another lox meat pie. That is our health food. It really, really is. Oh, I'm going to need to do some cooking between the next episode and this. I think the only thing I really had in abundance was bread. We're going to have serpent stew next time, though, guys, for sure. Oh, okay, dead end. Let's go back. Oh, okay, so that just took us in a big circle there. Hello, Oof. Oh, gosh. Ow, that actually hurt a good bit. 
Yeah, these caves are going to be dangerously difficult on a new game. Alright, there's another one. I'm gonna put all these side by side on a screen one day and just see if they tell any kind of so story. I'm really curious. Hi! Yeah! Here we go. Oh my gosh, that hurt. I need to stop fooling around so much. This is dangerous in these caves. More fur. More cloth, maybe? No, okay. Hello! Hello! Alright, let's get in here guys in your fire just keep chopping ah, oh man I do love these claws but man oh man they must be resistant to what what are these things doing slash yeah just slash damage that's okay though Well, all right, everybody, I guess I'm going to go ahead and let that wrap up the episode for today. Lots of fun running around these caves. I can't believe we found so many on this mountain. What does this make now? One, two, three, four, five, six, six on this. And, you know, that looks pretty circled, so I think we're done. I will swing over to this side, and if we're really lucky, we'll find another one here on the next episode on the way back to the boat. But then we'll take the boat out, and we'll sail to another mountain, and we'll try to find some more caves. Definitely want to spend one more episode running around in these amazing caves, trying to just collect some more... Uh, cloth and fur and fang and trophies and ool of trophies. You know, we're just going to get all this stuff and then we'll decorate up that iron cabin and make it look amazing. Plus, I'm having a lot of fun running around with this armor. Uh, really want to level it up with whatever we have left over from the decorating. That's going to be a lot of fun. But yeah, guys, like I said, we'll just be hopping around a couple more caves next episode. Just want to collect some more stuff so we can keep building. But I'm just repeating myself at this point. Hope you guys have had fun hanging out with me, jumping around all these caves. These caves have been so much fun. Tell me about your adventures. What was your first cave like? Leave me a little story down there in the comments. Tell me about your first time discovering a cave. You know, whether it was watching somebody else do it or exploring it yourself. Let me know what your first cave experience was like because my couple of first cave experiences have been amazing. But anyway, everybody, I hope you're having a great day. Have a great rest of your day, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Thanks for hanging out.